Tess, are you ready to solve some mysterious mysteries? Are you ready? Are you ready for the mysteries? Well, you've eliminated everything. What's left is nothing. That's what that's what Sherlock Holmes said, right? Is that uh, is that what they said? Yeah. When you when you've eaten all the enchiladas, what is left, no matter how improbable, must be dirty dishes. Is that? Is that it? Unless you lick the plate clean. I mean, there is that. Welcome back, everybody, to the Dojo Air Rage Light. I'm Jeff, and I'm Tess, and I'm hungry for enchiladas now. Thanks, Jeff. <laughs> I found over the course of running Rage Select Test that all I have to do is say the uh, any food, mm -hmm. and my co-hosts are like, now I want that. And it's just like... It's true. Modern we're, advertising is working too hard. You're we're very susceptible. Yep. So we're playing Sherlock Holmes, Chapter 1. Um, who's this guy playing the violin over there? Is this a spooky ghost? Some kind of spooky ghost? Because, uh, I mean, that's him right there, yeah? I think so. I, He's going to get his suit all dirty laying I on the ground. don't think Watson plays violin. Well, this, I think, is is pre-Watson, right? Yeah, it's like him it's with his brother. What's his, what's his name? Mycroft. Yeah, Mycroft. Subtitles on. Okay, that's all I cared about. New game! So, yeah, this is by Frog. Where's the guys that made The Sinking City? I love those guys. They're in this horrible dispute with the publisher of The Sinking City. Um, so I want to I wanna uh, shine a little light on their thing. Maybe everybody's tired of all the Call of Duties and the battlefields and all the shooty shoots. You want to solve some mystery mists. Mist, mystery, mist mysteries i like to solve mysteries remember that time we tried to solve mist yes Marie? it did not go well we did not get very far <laughs> that's what you need a mouthful of the good stuff and so is this guy like his mysteries. tyler durden thank you for your support john oh i guess i don't I john watson I, any ginger no i don't get i think so so in this world did they like know each other when they were younger i guess so i can see land through the porthole so much for docking by tea time. This is the second game they've made where you start off on a boat. Yeah. If we have to go to the Fish City full of eight men, that's going to be weird. Oh, we also play the game where the lady pushes her husband over the side. And overboard. Yeah, overboard and murders him. Oh, man. What if this is a crossover with Overboard? <laughs> <laughs> Except that all the characters from Overboard look like still cartoons. Yeah. And somehow they all sound like guys from Monty Python doing lady voices somehow. I think that this Sherlock is, he reminds me of the guy from that uh, Six of Crows or whatever. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. Oh, wow. Holy um, crap. That looks, he looks like a damp sex doll face. <laughs> like that just looked like silicone and not real flesh. I was like, oh, goody boy. <laughs> Something about that. It will be worth it. Thank you, John. And if you want to notify the captain's wife of his indiscretions, I will not stand in your way. What? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> uh, oh, at last. Um, quite ready to get off this cursed boat. Is it cursed? I don't. Come on. Is his we'll is his vest made out of leather and like the pattern from the haunted mansion? The brocade. I, is this is this Sherlock Holmes's hot topic face? Oh is my this God. is is Victorian hot topic? Look at this shit. Look at this shit. You, you know what they say if it if it's. Uh, not brocade, don't fix it? I don't know. <laughs> Rosie, that thing I saw where it was like, steampunk is what happens when goths find the color brown. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's what happens when they leave their black clothes out in the sun. It gets bleached. Yep. They're like, well, guess I'm steampunk All now. right, give me the goggles. <laughs> yeah. Time, Let's it's time. Let's glue some uh, cogs to this shirt. Oh, geez. Oh, boy. Okay. That's water, I guess. Water does that, yeah? It I looks like that. I don't know. I haven't been outside in a year and a half, so <laughs> I'm not sure what water does anymore. <coughs> I just drink coffee, so. It feels hey, like Sherry. that. Oh, oh, come on. oh. Catch up. Sherry? Yes, yes. His nickname is Sherry. That's what Watson calls him. I'm not entirely convinced. Look at, look at. He's got a chain wallet, what? for God's sake. What? He's got a chain wallet. It looks no. like he's got a pocket watch on his on his wrist oh, boy. with a silver chain. And he's got this little, this other little chain like he's a army guy what how has he has he okay he's folded the 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 he edges a, of his coat up and uh, then buttoned them in the back is yeah, that a yeah. thing uh i think yes okay uh ease of access to swords and or guns what about this man bag what about this oh, purse th that he's th got th th thigh bag yeah his, those are actually pretty fucking handy i like those and he's got one sleeve rolled up is that the half tuck of the Victorian era? Is one sleeve rolled up? That what do you need that for? It, Sherlock. Is he left handed? Maybe he doesn't want to get graphite on his sleeve. I don't know. Writes? I don't I, know, I, man. I don't know. So, what are we doing? We're checking in? Yeah, we're checking in. Skip man, that. his fashion is a bit out there. Oh, 
Thank you. All right. Wasn't he in Grand Budapest Hotel? I have absolutely no idea. We just need your signature. Okay. You can't have it. Mycroft. Oh. Yes, ah. <laughs> God. Is this, is this consumption? Is it consumption? Bees? Is it bees? I feel like his face is just made out of clay. Is he secretly a clay face? He looks like one of the fish people from the last game that oh, they did. Oh, I think did. I know what it is. His eyebrows are really light. Okay, so wait, like we're going to our room. He said go this That's way. That's weird looking. Whoa, these guys are ready these for a party. These guys are dapper as fuck. Oh, shit. I got we like are a, underdressed. A camera. Taking some pictures. Yeah. My room number is 221. Upstairs. Okay. Can, can Come on, that. Tyler. Let's go. <laughs> uh, I am Sherlock's that complete plant, lack that. of surprise. <laughs> is there a run button? What the fuck? What the hell? Fuck. Am I an animus? You guys got to tell me. What? Wait. Welsh Whoa. made? Uh, Sympath oh, look. He's got his, like, this is his Sherlock senses. Yeah, yeah. This is the I'm overly uh, observant <laughs> Sherlock's uh, like, I can tell everything from a lady's backside. Oh, my God. <laughs> Ted's horses. <laughs> it's like... Uh, people's hands tell you a lot about a person, but also their butts do as well. 227. Mm -hmm. Is this the run button? Oh, no. This is like the... Oh, that's the scan button. Your weird sense oh, scan Who are these buttons. guys? Who are these ladies? What yeah, are they doing? They're just, you know... just Italian engineer. Cool. Sleeps on her stomach. A friendly. That's hard to do. How does he know she sleeps on her stomach? The slight angle of her breasticles I... tell you that she's a stomach sleeper. Okay. I, I <laughs> actually... Breasticles? I don't know. <laughs> they're all Victorian and shit. I don't know what they're... They're, they're, they're slang. They're still... Well, they're still like giving women heroin because they're they've got the vapors and shit like in this time period so she's harms animals what? get her sherlock punch her in the face how do you do it which button is the punch button i'm harms taking your picture animals? for later wait how let me get the front at a glance <laughs> she's just got puppy blood on her hands <laughs> <laughs> i've studied for years i can tell the difference between puppy blood and emu blood um what the what? okay okay there's just, gotta be one of these it's a run button I really, did i pass my broom i really want the explanation for how he knows that like what <laughs> indubitably I, I my dear tessa to, i, I want to be able to know that at a glance so i can avoid those people yeah and or punch them like you said okay 226 okay okay 227 uh -huh. okay we're going the wrong way yeah going up and then okay the for serious game is there a goddamn run button or not photo camera analyze mo movement uh -huh. case book sprint uh -huh. oh okay it was just oh okay there da, we go. Da, 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 all right da, 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 all right da, 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 great uh so what do we got sherry in a hurry we got 225 uh -huh. then we got the orchestra don't, down there don't come through here this is only for musicians uh, musicians only are they having a, a white party is it like before labor day hmm. what is look at this hat I look know. at this guy's hat oh, that's pretty it's like a blue fez yeah wow he's got it all going on wait what's what's like up what's gold, his deal gold embroidery Just tell me his deal he's an albanian noble no. and oh. a night hawk what's a night hawk this is tv dinner am i gonna uh, have to just start googling some of these wait phrases? a minute why okay so he's got the glass in his hand tessa mm -hmm. And then when I go into detective vision, he loses the glass in his hand. <laughs> my detective, my my visions, I cannot see glasses. Uh, is this room 221, signore? Signore? Help me, please. I have nothing to hide, sir, but I've never heard of this. What? He's never heard of room 221. It's a ghost room for ghosts. Let's try this side. Huh. Okay, 223. Oh, my God. We're so close. 222. Okay, so I just looked up uh, the term Nighthawk. Okay. So slang term Yeah. Uh, is uh, to wake up in the morning still drunk from the night before. Oh. And then continues to drink. So alcoholic. So yeah. Okay. They could just call them out. I guess. Perhaps oh. In the meantime, you would like to relax in the foyer? Tonight, the restaurant is offering a complimentary Marlin ceviche to all our Ooh, guests. Ooh, Marlin ceviche. Ooh. Let's go get some Marlin ceviche. Also, Nighthawk means an individual who knowingly uses a metal detector in illegal activity, particularly involving theft from a protected archaeological site and or from private land. So, like, somebody who sneaks into, like, Indiana Jones's dig and they, like, take some, some pots and stuff in the middle of the night. So, he's either an Indiana Jones Ooh. villain or an alcoholic or potentially both. Maybe it's an alcoholic Indiana Jones Thanks, villain. Google. Okay, tell me. Just our luck. This is that ceviche. Mm. John wants me to inspect an advertisement. Okay. What? That that sign there probably on the little kickstand boy. What is that? Ooh, it's like hey, a Sherry. 
Just our luck. Oh. Luca. John, haven't we been through this already? Galici? Galici? Come on, isn't Yeah, that's really hard to read. Oh, are we meeting the medium? Oh, who's this? He's got a little sketchbook there. Is he an artiste? Maybe. Mr. Galici's conducting a Oh, whoa. Oh my god. What the fuck are those glasses? Or inspector. What? Oh, no. Pardon me. Why should I sit for a portrait? I Is he like a matrix extra? Like where did this guy come from? Does its own justification. Like he does not fit into this world at all whatsoever. Yeah. Systems or beliefs. How about art as the lens through which we see the truth of the world? I'm pretty sure he tries to kill Tomb Raider <laughs> in the latest movie. It's just the Watch out, Angelina! <laughs> speaking of archaeological <laughs> digs. To see it, just an open mind. Huh. That seems rather close minded. Truth, like beauty. Oh my god. Hit him with the ceviche, That's Sherlock. That's what something a liar says. <laughs> Anybody starts spouting that shit and you're like, oh, you're into Deal dairy, dog. Oh! He pulled an Immortan Joe on him. What did he say? He said, he asked what he saw and he showed him his portrait. And he said, mediocrity. Slam. That guy was kind of a dick. And I'll find us a table. I'm yeah, I'm going to grab this whole plate of ceviche. I was trying to do that before and then you were like, look at this okay, fortune teller. John, <laughs> look at this ad. Okay. What? You what, sir? Yes? Look, the light? What oh, about the light? Uh, okay. Okay, it's like, all right. Please look at this ad for the show that you're obviously going to debunk while we're sitting there and just be a big old fucking party pooper. Yeah. Poop in the party, Sherlock. You know, Where is, you uh, know he is. Dude, I, I'm. Oh my God, that chain is really something else. <laughs> like. Where did John go? Mm -hmm. He said. That's the next mystery. Where did John go? He wanted me to grab the ceviche, and I did. Yeah, did he get us a table somewhere? Let me tell what uh, this maid's butt tells me. <laughs> what is this? She's a former dancer. Oh, she's also very sympathetic. Okay. okay. That's um, a sympathetic butt. <laughs> <laughs> I want to write a Sherlock Holmes story, but it turns out that this version of Sherlock Holmes can only intuit by looking at people's asses. Uh, <laughs> it'll be called Sherbutt Holmes. Sherlock Butts. Oh, my God. Sherbutt Holmes. Oh, nope. Mm. Oh, God. There we go. You have a bear? Is that a bear? What is that? That's a cool little I'll put cane. down the ceviche. I guess he's a even real person? It's going to be a long yeah, he's a real person. Oh, I don't know. Well, I mean, they're fictional so characters, but in the game, John is real. He's got a friggin' skater cut, all right? Uh, oh, promise me it isn't nonsense. After being cooped up on that boat, I am itching for activity. That's just oh, syphilis. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, uh, oh, wow. oh, okay, so we're going to have to do some intuitions. So nice. All right, let's take a look at this Kane's butt. Take me a minute, John, at most. Well, then, you can well it's it got a pharaoh on it. Of some kind. <laughs> then what are the staff here for? Aesthetics? Oh, he's a Ponzi boy, huh? Mm -hmm. to do. Slapping oneself in the face is also something to do. That doesn't make it worth. Is there a button to make him shove ceviche in his dumb face? That's what I want to do. <laughs> just fucking house that whole just plate like, of ceviche. Shh, just don't speak, Sherlock. I'm, I'm, Sherry. Okay, here we go. Okay, let's go. Inspect. It out. What do we got? We oh, got. Uh, the hand grip is a head of a golden Javanese statue. Okay. Stolen from a temple. The oh, dense. maybe it's the Nighthawk. Maybe the Nighthawk stole it. You looked up Nighthawk, and that might be. I did. The cane is made of ebony. It's worn uncared for, and bears the scars of numerous. Uh huh. Man, somebody's using this to just beat on people. Apparently, uh -huh. maybe it's like some kind of. There's kinda... like a slight split there, almost. There's like a little crack there, a yeah, bit. Yeah, that doesn't. A little Let's slight see. gouge. Look at that symbol there. Is Wait, that how about an, this? Is that an onion? Crest depicting a bold oh, garlic. Very close. Mm. Good eye. Yeah. Or meadows, or craven from the old English name meaning garlic place. Hmm. This cane is an expensive. <laughs> garlic man. place. The hunter is Spider-Man's worst enemy. Its owner must be vain, volatile, and of noble English blood. Okay. Okay. Get with you, Sherry. Let's return it to its own. Vain and. Uh, All right. I hope you noted down your observation. What was the second one? Vain something and of English blood. Noble. Noble. It was probably our Nighthawk. <laughs> okay, so shall I can ask bystanders? Press the thing to open the pay case book. <clears throat> Pin a piece of evidence. Cases. The lost cane. Okay. Mm -hmm. Pin evidence. 
Okay. Try, okay, press details for more. Mm, British S- nobleman. Okay, that guy we saw. <clears throat> sorry, I'm losing my voice here. <clears throat> um, the guy we saw up there. Let's see. May I ask for your assistance? There was a Nighthawk, right. was not You're lucky there British. Is I know about this. Oh, okay. So now somebody, now they do know something. Mm. There were three people at the table, a mm-hmm. couple and a retired Navy officer. Observers weren't sure what happened to the couple, but the Navy officer was seen going out in the front garden for some air. I bet he's been murdered. Oh, maybe. I bet you he's been murdered in the garden. Murdered. Dollars to donuts. That man is dead. Wait. Okay. Try to find the naval officer. Wait. What? Isn't he outside, though? Yeah, I said he went out in the garden. Oh, okay. Well, oh, that guy had a, a, a knife. And that okay. lady is agoraphobic. Where's the? Is this the garden? The garden. Let's go to the garden. The garden. Hey, British nobleman, Hello. Navy officer. <laughs> Hello. Scotch pyromaniac. Maniac? Oh my God. Arab teacher, non-religious, <laughs> friendly, friendly French, French judge. judge. Okay. Okay. Uh, no, nope, oh, this, this one. But this guy right here. A little bit, a little bit closer. He's selling, Closelier? selling monorails, or tell me about monorail, this guy. Monorail, monorail, monorail. German. They got him in Ogdenville <laughs> and Haverbrook, and that put them on the map. <laughs> anyway, sorry. Um, <clears throat> All right, where's this navalman? How about you, sir? Noble sniffs tobacco. Turkish judge, syphilitic. Oh, you were saying earlier. Yeah. Cordonia aristocrat suffers from food poisoning. Friendly. It's friendly. <laughs> okay. Maybe. Don't eat the ceviche. Um, <laughs> is this the garden? Nope. Oh, we can't go through there. So this I is... I have to locate the former Navy officer who garden? went into the front garden. Is this the back garden? Could you help me? My dear fellow, you're talking to the right... Sweet Son Jesus. of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Uh-huh. All right. Now I have a perfect excuse to enter the seance room. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. So, how do... Mm. He, that guy knows that the owner is in the seance room. Okay. Uh, so that wasn't the naval officer, because I was like, that guy doesn't read naval officer, but whatever. I mean, some people are in their wait, what, Sunday best is or it, whatever. Isn't that... Uh, <sighs> the naval officer was sitting at our table... Uh. Been talked about yachting. Perhaps you put it aside. Well, let's see if the, um, like, is this the seance room? I would assume so. Cut well, there scene. you go. Oh, thank Well, there you go. And Bob's your uncle. I apologize to everybody out there. What? Um, say what now? What? What? <laughs> oh. First my cane, now the diamond. <laughs> what the Wait. fuck is happening? <laughs> Why are they fighting Edgar Allan Poe? <laughs> they stumble. Oh, are we gonna fight? Mm-hmm. Young Wait, boy, that's my cane. Yeah. I get that a lot. It's a very common design. <laughs> what? No, that's a custom made. Why are you antagonizing him, Sherlock? A joke. It was left a joke. A joke. I thought it deserved to be returned. Here you go, bud. Well, I'll be. It is rare to encounter a straight-fingered troop any these days. <laughs> what? Uh huh. Just ask, how did you know I was the rightful owner? Turn around, and I'll tell you. Um, let's see. Observe. Let's see. Oh, we can actually like, we can do this on him. Uh huh. Swollen, reddish face. Uh, a true penny and a trusty, honest fellow. Expensive new clothes, rich and fashionable. Mm. And then, oh. ooh. The, that there you go doesn't wear a wedding ring but uh, oh but it's got a head of, of garlic. garlic yep he's got some bloody nucks uh, recently hit someone with force let's see uh, let's see so being constantly drunk uh-huh he has issues with or let's see by his red knuckles i presume okay wait what do we got here uh generally a heraldic emblem on his signet ring and cane i can be fairly certain that this man is lord craven mm-hmm. a noble englishman in the habit of visiting resorts receive treatment for his liver malady sure his forward facing the case he has succumbed to the temptation of drink a few shots of alcohol perhaps unsettled by the seance sure his red knuckles i assume that he's taken boxing lessons to strengthen his physical condition already annoyed by the disappearance of his cane he is now infuriated by the theft of a diamond or uh blah 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 floored face indicate he has problems with alcohol constantly drunk his red knuckles this one seems like it's got more like what well so we gotta choose between the two yeah so he's either bored british nobleman or an ill englishman on resort right he travels around europe squandering his money or 
liver malady, <sighs> red face, swollen reddish skin. I'm going to go with malady because he got the reddish skin. Mm. Red face. I don't know. He could also be a bored British nobleman because he got that crazy custom fancy cane. Who yeah. Knows? I mean, his face just might. His red knuckles face really beat one person. His issues mixed to make him quite a violent person. I don't know. This is a good... I don't really know hmm. if there's anything... Can we look at more stuff? Can we go back and look more? I don't think so. I think there's that's, that's kind of all we got. Nah. All we've got is pick which one, scroll, and then confirm portrait. Yeah, I'm not going to assume he takes boxing lessons. I just know that he's probably just hit someone just now. Okay, let's go board British Nobleman. Let's try it. Uh, do 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 Okay. That's my... Simple deduction. Your cane told me everything I needed to know. I was after a strong middle-aged man with a keen interest in adventure, noble blood, and affection for strong drink. And if one Get him, Sherlock! The one may even be able to extrapolate your name from your heraldic symbol, Lord Craven. Marvelous. Simply marvelous. Oh. That's me. All right. Lord Andrew Craven. Good job, Tessa. You are the real medium. Oh, shit. That, Emma? Well, <laughs> you can locate my diamond too. Oh, yes. okay. You yeah, I was like, just because he's got futzed up knuckles now doesn't mean he always boxes. True. Do it, then I'm sure the local police can suffice. The police? Why bother? I know this Harlequin stole it. Harley Quinn is here? <laughs> hey, Mr. J. <laughs> I mean, Mr. H. Right. My stick and I'll resolve the matter that's myself. what I that's my second that's the sequel to Sherlock Butts mm -hmm. is Sherlock Butts meets that's Harley Quinn nice um, questionable veracity fine I shall spare you and he the trouble if you first answer me this okay uh what happened at the seance let's yeah. see what happened at the seance insist the medium robbed you during the seance but what occurred ah, it was a dirty trick we were sitting here in the dark, uh -huh. chanting and holding hands. Is John okay over there? I don't know. <laughs> then he began to appear from the media. Oh. Like a, a cloud or a bubble. The swindler called it Ecto. Huh. Is it, it was that Slimer from that yes. new Ghostbusters the movie. The trade and quite the spectacle. Indeed. Perhaps too much. My beloved Emma um, screamed in horror and I stood to I've seen photographs of that faked, but I've never, afraid. like... Heard of anyone actually seeing it firsthand? Yeah. The medium jumped away from me and Emma huh. fainted. You talked to Jason Murphy. He knows all about debunking this stuff. Mm. I went to a seance once. It was weird. Yeah. yeah. Where, where at? Uh, it. Uh, it was at like a bar. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and there was like a tiny little theater thing in the back. Okay. And I went with my ex, and it's a person doing kind of showing the the tricks of the seances. So. Was it, were you guys at Butterfly Bar? Maybe. Or the Vortex? Maybe. That might be it. Might have been it. Yeah. I don't remember. From that description, it sounds like that place. Yeah. It was a tiny little room that was super hot. Hmm. Can you describe the stone itself? A yellow diamond, not less than 100 carats. Uh-huh. Perfectly egg-shaped. There is not another like it. Okay. Stay here and don't touch anything. I'm going to investigate further. Investigations! I'll be keeping a close eye on this thief. All right. I mean, you know what? So my yes. guess, okay. Yes. Uh, we're not going to be able to go too much further, but yes, here's, my, here's my guess. Yes. He doesn't want the police involved. Yes. He says it's a yellow diamond. It's worth a lot. Yes. Bet you money, that diamond isn't worth shit. And he's got insurance on it, and it's just a common everyday citrine. Oh, okay. Because those things aren't worth that much. Uh, if you see a scribbled white circle, press the right bumper. I kind of dig this. This reminds me a little bit of... Um, the diamond was placed on the table so that all participants could reach it. Oh. Uh, I, I like the, the kind of deduction thing. Yeah. What? Too bad there's not enough for a proper chemical analysis. Uh, I... I... I, I kind of dig this take yeah. also. The kind of young Sherlock Holmes. Sure. Um... I like that old movie though too, so I might just be a sucker for a young Sherlock. His Holmes. fashion is a little too hot gothic for me, but you know. <laughs> uh, let's see. We've seen. No, we've already seen these. Okay, sorry. I will get back into it instead of like me guessing way ahead because we're not going to be able to play it all the way through. Um, let's see. Can I? But yeah, that guy. That different... guy just has insurance on that diamond, probably, and he wants it to be stolen. Hence, let's not involve the police. Is there? What about? Okay, uh, <clears throat> broken wine glass. Mm -hmm. There are light traces of rouge on the edge of this wine glass. Yep. 
Whoa, what's all this? Ugh. Is that the is that the ectoplasm? Ghost jizz. Oh no, not the ghost jizz. That or it's someone spilled a lot of Elmer's glue. Like they're uh, wheat pasting, you know. Yeah. They they they're postering, you know. Uh what is the last thing? It's four out of five. Okay. Where's um, the fifth? You got the glass, you got the tablecloth, you got uh, the wait, thing. these? You look at that, good? Uh, what did. about the glass? The glass, yes. Glass did. That, what about that jacket? Jacket. Jacket? Jacket. Full metal jacket. Jacket, 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 jacket. Jacket. Can no, we it's do got it a butterfly on it. Look at the butterfly. Aha! Zoom, zoom, zoom. Okay. Oh, okay. This brooch is old and cheap, but the moth design has its charm. It's cute. All right. Well, that was that it? New Mind Palace clue. Yay. Apparently, how do I? Okay, so you get out of there. Mm -hmm. Let's. Uh, what's in the What's in the Mind Palace? Okay. Craven, Lady Craven faced the widow. Window. Lady Craven. Window. Window. Okay. During the seance. Lady Craven's place at the table was opposite a window to the courtyard. Mm -hmm. So that would be this window. Is there something about the window? Window opposite. Did she the courtyard? see something? Turn around. Is there another window? How many windows are in this room? Well, it's got to be that one then. Okay. In high du dungeon. In what? I, I have no idea. <laughs> 1,000 years dungeon! <laughs> uh, wait. Oh, affable. Barely conscious. Du dungeon. Dungeon. Huh. I don't know what dungeon is. Uh, what? Why did all the skulls turn? Hmm. We gotta. We gotta get in. Magnets. Oh yeah, how do uh, they work? He's so in high was dungeon is purpose? furious or resentful. Okay. Dangerous to leave a mirror exposed during a seance. The spirits may become enraged, or someone may notice the trick they should not see. Oh, and then we've got the the veil. Okay. And they put over the person's face and they sit in the chair. Okay. So we got a mirror here too. Why? What are you doing, John? I told you. He was like <laughs> over there, just like didn't know what to do with himself. I summoned it as usual, but then it all went wrong. The lady screamed and pointed at Lord Craven. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And there was a shadow. Uh -huh. Such a mystical force. It terrified the lady. Uh -huh. And it must have taken the diamond. Who else could have? Why is he got out? What's on his neck? I will investigate and the culprit will be identified. Me. Nee. This stubborn brute Lord Craven blames me right now. As if I could do something like that. Yeah. B perhaps you can reason with him. Please. Oh, since you said please. Okay, so there's that. Oh. Sure oh, key evidence speak. collected. Wait, the mind palace? The moth pen, maybe? Go. Okay, so what do we got? We've got Luca owns a pen in the shape of moth. Lady pointed across the table. Wait, go back. Lady Craven pointed across. Okay. So wait, what does it say? Examine your clues to get answers. Choose your current case, select a clue, combine it with a relevant one uh -huh. to get new evidence and then make a deduction. Gotcha. So Lady Craven faced the window and pointed across the table. Uh-huh. So is there something out the window? Lady Craven was pointing at the window. I'm sure she saw someone in the courtyard during the seance. Okay. So can, does that mean that we can now like... Talk to someone in the courtyard, see what they saw? Yeah. Do you see what I see? It's really, it's really hard to make like... Um, that guy. To make like look at that nerd deduction like mystery games mm -hmm. right because if it's too hard like the player will get confused. Uh, if it's too easy. It's not enough it's, of it's, a challenge. It's not very fun. So I I, I really appreciate Frogwares trying to do that. Oh, it's another one of them pearl divers. Uh, Wait, I can't talk to him. Apparently he does not. Dishes. Let's see. Somehow I don't Wait, think that's oh, what that's like here we go. means. What's There's that? something on the ground. Is that some to goo? I don't know. Let's find out. Recently, Recently scratched. Scratch. Something stuck. What the heck is that? Oh, oh it's a uh, broken heel. Oh, yeah. Oh. Sure is. That's called a kitten heel. Yeah? I believe so. So can I, I take it? Is it? Did I find it? So wait, is that my mind palace now? No. Oh, I guess not. Mm -hmm. Deductions. Mm -hmm. So we would need to find somebody with a broken heel. Yeah, see if there's a lady walking funny somewhere. Is there? Oh, we're in the back back rooms now. Holy shit. Uh, 
All right. Well, you know what? We have to we have to call it a day. Okay. Uh, wait, wait. Is it maybe one of the maids or somebody? You might notice uh, their shoes. She has both of them. Um, her heels. Yeah. Check one of the ones upstairs. See if one of the maids like is missing a heel. <laughs> I bet Suddenly you. Tessa is super invested. Yeah, this, um, check, look at this one. Check the shoes. Uh, nope. Nope. Okay, she's got both of them. Yep. Uh well, thanks everybody for watching. Hit like, subscribe button. <laughs> While we stare at these women's feet like we're <laughs> fucking going to direct It's not Pulp that fiction. kind of channel. <laughs> it's not that kind of YouTube channel. Like, like and subscribe. <laughs> uh, let us know what you think down in the comments. Um, Please comment if you're Quentin Tarantino and you're enjoying this. <laughs> That's right. If you're Quentin Tarantino, let me know. I, I want to know that you're watching. <laughs> you have to tell us if you're Quentin videos. Tarantino. You just mail me at mailragelight.com. <laughs> uh, I'll, I'll take it that way, too. Um, yeah, patreon.com forward slash uh, ragelight helps out kick some bucks. Uh, come to the Discord server, chillax, hang out, all of those various things. Um, yeah. Oh, there's a letter. Oh, also, what you got? Uh, Angie. A honey plotter's note. Oh. Looks like the old man has been losing. His beehives are being ransacked, and his bees are going down one by one. I don't think there's much honey left in staying with the swarm, if you catch my drift. Oh, wow. Maybe by the docks at noon, we'll do it together. Okay. okay. Is she <laughs> is she part of the What's what, that symbol? Oh, yeah, what the hell? What the hell is that? Oh, it's a bee. It's a wasp. Yeah. And he's got like three little honeycombs under him. Can I take a picture of it? Yeah, take a picture. All right. Is they did they uh was like the 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 medium had like a deal where he had like a, a co-conspirator, but then the co-conspirator is like, uh it's it's getting thin. I got to cut and run, so they decided to fleece. So we can't talk to this guy? Like, he's obvious. Mm, anyways. Nope. Uh, anyway, Tessa, where can the people find you on the internet? Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah, they can find me on uh, Instagram uh, under Tessa Morrison, all one word. Um, and then also I got a art show coming up at Guzu Gallery here in Austin. I'll have a fiber Thank art you piece. Thank helping us resolve the situation, sir. In a uh, anime-themed art show. There you go. Yeah, so I'll be there for most of December into January. Cool. All right, that's it. That's the Sherlock Holmes. I think everybody should go get this game if this looks interesting to you because uh, I'm having a good time. It seems like a it seems like a pretty cool one. This is a pretty cool one. I think they did something. Yeah, check out that skull. But there's like some what about this lady? fucking. Unsteady breathing. She's barely conscious. Feebleness of women. Oh my God. Ah, uh, Sherlock. Yeah, you tell him, John. Yeah. Sherlock is a bit of a womanizer over here. Come on, what Sherlock. A jag. Anyway, we have to stop now oh, yeah. or play forever. Bye, um, everybody. Bye. <laughs>